Hi guys, this is Saurav. In this video, we will learn how to create barcode scanner app using CodeRuler. Okay, so first we see the example here. So here you can see that's the app here. Okay, now I'm going to click on scan barcode. Okay, and I'm going to scan one code here. Okay, so I'm going to search in my just click on scan barcode allow Fine now I'm going to type here uh, barcode example something and let's scan this code Fine, you will see that's the value of our barcode here, right? You can save this value, uh, right? Okay, you can use there are a lot of use of this value. Okay, so that's very easy way to scan the code. Okay, so here we go. So we need to click on create project here and your project name barcode scanner and click on next and then finish. So here you can see that's the screen here. Now we need to drag and drop one button here first. Okay, and we need to drag and drop one scanner. So you will get this in this section. That one is uh, where is sensor options and you will see a barcode scanner just drag and drop this this one is non-visible component okay so we are going to change this button name here and i'm going to make it scan barcode like this and i'm going to make this one is with this full parent fine now uh, i'm going to use here one label to display the barcode value okay so we will get this image where is label that one label just drag and drop this label and make this one with this full parent and make this at least 20 font size and that one value should be something uh, code like this okay easy now go to the block section okay and Whenever someone click on the button one, it means click on button one and you will see when button one dot click, then click on bar code scanner and you will see here call bar code scanner dot do scan. So whenever we click on the button, so this will bar code will enable and this will scan the bar code. Okay. After scanning the bar code, we have to save or we have to get the value from it. So and we will get this value in label okay so click on barcode scanner and you will see when barcode is scan after barcode is scan we have to set this result in label so click on label and you will see here set label one dot text you will find it here set label one dot text like this and this one result get result okay okay so you cannot test this app okay you have to make apk file go to the export option and generate qr code for app okay and you have to download this app then you can use this app you cannot test this app okay you have to uh, if you want to test this app so you have to make a apk file for this okay so i'm going to make the apk file and here i will show you how it's look and how it's work so here you can see that's the app here Okay, now I'm going to click on scan barcode. Okay, and I'm going to scan one code here. Okay, so I'm going to search in my just click on scan barcode allow Fine now I'm going to type here uh, barcode example something and let's scan this code Fine, you will see that's the value of our barcode here, right? You can save this value, uh, right? Okay, you can use there are a lot of use of this value. Okay, so that's very easy way to scan the code. Okay, thank you so much for watching this video. If you have any doubt, you can ask me on comment. And please subscribe my channel, like this video, share this video. Have a nice day. Be safe. Bye bye.